Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Serrano. Welcome back to another video. We're going to be taking a look at the Samsung Galaxy A13 and how to make it run faster. And this might even work for your A12 as well, but make sure you stay to the end of the video so you can get all the tips on how to make your A13 run faster. But if you're brand new, I truly appreciate you for coming through. And if you're already a part of the crew, so... All right guys, so let's jump into the number one way to make the Samsung Galaxy A13 run faster. And these are in no particular order. You could do these pretty much any order you want. So the first way we can make it run faster is by going to the most recent app screen. Let me see. Now, right now I have, um, all right, so the first thing I'm gonna talk about how to make it run faster is to go to your recent app screen right here. And what you wanna do is when you get that screen open, let me see if I could get it. It's like not, there we go, okay. Once you get that screen open, you wanna close the windows that you're not using, guys. You wanna have as, uh, as minimum windows as you possibly can on this device open at one single time because as soon as you open up five or more windows on this device that's when it's going to show lag so you what you want to do is when you're using an app on this device and you see that there's a little bit of lag on the app right like let's say you open up instagram and it's you see it's really really slow what you want to do is you want to go to the most recent apps swipe up right here and then close off all the other apps you're not using and then go back into it. And you're gonna notice the phone working actually really quickly after you do that. So that's gonna be the first way to make your A13, you know, run a little bit faster. So I just wanna throw that out there, okay? All right guys, so now this is the second way to make your Samsung Galaxy A13 run faster. So we wanna go into um settings okay and then after you click settings right you're gonna go into something called you know device care so we just go all the way down below where it says battery and device care okay and then after you click that right you're gonna hit the memory feature right so you can see right here we do have battery storage and memory you want to hit memory okay so once you hit memory right you want to wait for it to check your memory and actually help you optimize your memory, okay? So you can see right here, it says 60, 630 megabytes, okay? So you wanna actually clean this and it's gonna start closing out everything that you're not using for your memory and optimize your performance, okay? So I just wanted to throw that out there that that's the, um, you know, the second reason to make your A13 run faster. All right, so this is the third way, okay? to make it run faster, stay inside of memory, right? Because right now you could see that right now we are using three gigabytes used of memory, okay? So what you wanna do is use the reserve memory that you have on this device as an additional feature that they added, right? So you wanna click RAM plus, okay? And you can see right here, the RAM uses your phone storage space to provide virtual memory, choose more memory to allow more apps to stay open in the background, right? And choose less memory to keep the storage more storage on your phone free okay so click this option where it says four and then just hit the reset button right now okay so after you hit that button you just want to wait for your samsung galaxy a13 to go back and reset back to the normal way and i'll get right back with you okay all right guys so the samsung galaxy a13 has been completely reset okay so I'm gonna go back into the memory option so you can see what I did, right? So let's just go right here into settings, right? And then after you hit settings, what you wanna do is go back down where you see device battery care, right? So hit the, that option where you can see the battery care and device care, and then go into memory one more time, right? Click that option in the memory option, okay? And that, that's when it's gonna check your memory one more time, right? So you can see right here that Right now we do have reserved memory for four gigabytes on the on right here, okay? So you can see that it's actually giving us more memory. And so it's gonna make your device a lot faster, okay? For And it's gonna actually keep more apps open in the background as well. So the next thing you can do 
to make your device run faster is go into settings, right? And go down into the software update part of this device, right? And then click download and install. And if you don't have an update right now, that's okay. But what you want to do is always keep your device up to date, right? Because it's going to optimize the performance every single time you get a new update. So right now we are on the March 1st update. So I just wanted to share that right now. But once I see an update come in for this device, you just want to make sure you check every single day, maybe every other week, just so that you don't fall behind when it comes to the updates, okay? So that's going to actually make your device run quicker because it's going to fix bugs and everything of that nature, right? Now, the fifth way that you can make the Samsung Galaxy A13 run faster is by going into your accessibility and turning off this option, right? So you wanna to go to accessibility and you wanna to go to visible visibility enhancements, right? And then you wanna actually click this option where it says remove animations, okay? Because when you do that, it's gonna actually uh, be a little bit zippier. You won't see any of the screen flaws when you're using it, everything is gonna feel a little bit quicker because those 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 animations aren't loading for you, right? So I just wanna mention that if you do remove animations on here, it will seem for the it will give you a little bit of better performance from you know using this uh, phone. You will be able to get some better performance out of here and it will run a little bit faster, right? Now, if you are still here, just type in the comment section right now, I'm still here, okay? So I know that you're still rocking with me. So we could jump into the last tip, which I think is we're gonna be dramatically improving the overall speed of this device, right? So make sure you just comment down below so I know you're still rocking with me so we could jump into the next tip, okay? So the last thing I wanna talk about to make the A13 run faster is to replace this One UI 4.1 with a custom launcher, okay? And the one we're gonna use is called Rootless Pixel Launcher from the Play Store. So you just go right here, okay? And then you go into this, this option right here and you could type Stock Launcher, right? And one of the things I noticed is that this one comes up Rootless Launcher, which is actually pretty cool, okay? And it's gonna have a lot of things um, here. It's a, really, it's a stock Android, it's a stock Android um, launcher. So after you have that downloaded on your phone, right? You want to go into settings okay so go uh let me see click settings okay and then after you click that right you want to go into the apps so click the, the the inside of settings click apps okay once you click apps wait one second and then scroll down right here and you're going to see choose the full apps okay click the full apps and then also click app um home app right so click home app and then choose rootless pixel launcher okay and this is going to give your phone a better performance because it's going to basically be less. Uh, it's, it's, I noticed right away that the performance was quicker on here and there was less lag when I was trying to get from point A to point B on the Samsung Galaxy A13. OK, so as soon as they fix any issues with the 4.1, then we'll go back to that. But right now it seems to be a little bit stuttery because it's still on the March security update, right? So I'm gonna be using the Google Pixel, this actual rootless launcher until the, uh, the performance actually smoothens out with some updates, right? But that's the last thing that would make the Samsung Galaxy A13 run faster in my opinion, but hopefully you guys did find this video helpful, informative, or useful. And then once you add the launcher, you can customize your widgets here and you can you could do that. It's definitely gonna be pretty cool because then you're gonna be able to add your own widgets um, on this device.